Welcome to the spoken tutorial on for and for each loops in Perl. In this tutorial, we will learn about for loop in Perl and for each loop in Perl. I am using Ubuntu Linux 12.04 operating system and Perl 5.14.2. I will also be using the gedit text editor. You can use any text editor of your choice. You should have basic knowledge of variables and comments in Perl. If not, please go through the relevant spoken tutorials on the spoken tutorial website. Perl provides a mechanism by which we can check a condition repeatedly for various values. This is done using loops. There are various types of loops in Perl. For loop, for each loop, while loop and do while loop. In this tutorial, we will cover for and for each loop. For loop in Perl can be used to execute a piece of code for a certain number of times. The syntax of for loop is as follows. For space open bracket variable initialization semicolon condition semicolon increment close bracket press enter open curly bracket piece of code to be executed multiple times close curly bracket now let us look at an example of a for loop open the terminal and type gedit for loop dot pl space ampersand and press enter this will open the for loop dot pl file in gedit type the following piece of code hash exclamation mark slash usr slash bin slash perl press enter for space open bracket dollar i equals to zero semicolon space dollar i less than equal to four semicolon space dollar i plus plus close bracket space open curly bracket press enter type print space double quote value of i colon dollar i slash n double quote complete semicolon and press enter now close the curly bracket press ctrl s to save the file let me explain what the for loop does the variable i is initialized to zero next the condition is checked in this case the condition is i less than or equal to 4 if this condition is true the code within the curly bracket will be executed this means the first print statement value of i colon 0 will be displayed on the terminal after this the variable i is incremented by 1 and the for loop condition is checked once again this loop will exit when the value of i becomes greater than 4 in this case the for loop will be executed for i equals to 0 1 2 3 and 4 which is a total of 5 times. Now switch to terminal. Type the following to check for any compilation or syntax error. Perl hyphen c for loop dot pl and press enter. Here it displays a message for loop dot pl syntax ok. So we have no errors. Now let us execute the Perl script by typing Perl for loop dot pl and press enter the following output will be shown on the terminal now let us look at for each loop if we want to iterate a condition for an array we can make use of for each loop the syntax is for each space dollar variable space within brackets at the rate array space open curly bracket perform action on each element of an array press enter close the curly bracket please note we will cover array array initialization and defining an array in subsequent tutorials now let us look at an example of for each loop open the terminal and type gedit 
for each loop dot pl space and percent and press enter this will open the for each loop dot pl file in gedit type the following piece of code hash exclamation mark slash usr slash bin slash pearl and press enter at the rate my array space equal to space open bracket 10 comma 20 comma 30 close the bracket semicolon press enter for each space dollar var space open bracket at the rate my array close the bracket space open curly bracket press enter and type print space double quote element of an array is colon dollar var slash n double quote complete semicolon press enter and close the curly bracket press ctrl s to save the file let me explain what this code does an array my array is declared it has three elements 10 20 and 30 in each iteration of for each loop dollar var will contain the single element of an array for each keyword will repeat this loop for each element of an array that is the code within the curly bracket will be executed for each my array element backslash n will place the prompt on a new line this means the first element 10 will be displayed on the terminal then 20 and so on till all the elements are printed this loop will exit after printing all the elements in my array now switch to terminal and type the following to check for any compilation or syntax error type perl hyphen c for each loop dot pl and press enter the following line will be shown on the terminal there are no compilation or syntax error so let us execute the perl script type perl for each loop dot pl and press enter the following output will be shown on the terminal so that's it about for loop and for each loop let us summarize in this tutorial we have learned for loop and for each loop in Perl using some sample programs here is assignment for you declare a string as spoken tutorial and print it five times declare an array of colors as at the rate color array equal to open bracket in single quote red comma white comma blue close the bracket and print the element of an array using for each loop watch the video available at the following link it summarizes the spoken tutorial project if you do not have good bandwidth you can download and watch it the spoken tutorial project team conducts workshops using spoken tutorials gives certificates to those who pass an online test for more details please write to contact at spoken-tutorial.org spoken tutorial project is a part of the talk to a teacher project it is supported by the national mission on education through ict mhrd government of india more information on this mission is available at spoken-tutorial.org slash nmeict hyphen intro. Hope you enjoyed this Perl tutorial. This is Amol signing off. Thanks for joining.